Today we discuss the iconic album tones of Burzum. Life is a prison. The first three Burzum releases are cold and haunting. Let's hear what I've recreated. Good. There were two amps used when recording these albums, along with some very nice recording techniques. Let's hear how the recreation sits in the full mix. It'll give us a better understanding of the tone. Before we reveal the amps, let's discuss. Can you hear ambience through the game? This was due to miking up the amps at a distance. The album was tracked in a hall. You, however, can achieve this reverb by simply buying any cheap reverb pedal or plug-in. Any pedal can basically do a hall setting these days. There was no additional gain placed in front of the amps. This means there is no use to add in a distortion pedal. The first amp used was a Marshall Lead 10. This was a solid state amp, obviously by the brand Marshall. The second amp, a PV Studio Pro. To gain, or in better words, to get the sound of a solid state PV, if you can't get your hands on the Studio Pro, I recommend getting a Bandit, a Fury, a Rage, they all pretty much sound similar and they will all bring you to that tone. If there's one tip to take away from this video, it's all in the miking technique. Uh, if you're going to try and recreate the tone and mic up your sound, do not put your microphone placed straight on the cabinet. Mic at a distance, soak up some room sound and let that natural ambience creep in.